Let's try to find the intersection of the lines y equals negative 1 fourth x plus 3 and negative 2x plus y equals negative 6. Although it's not necessary, I'm going to take that second equation and I'm going to add 2x to both sides. So that way we can get a different alternative equation that says y equals, let's see, we'll cancel that out, y equals 2x minus 6. This provides extra uh, advantage in that both equations are now written in the y equals mx plus b or slope intercept form. So for the blue equation, the top equation, let's make a little t-table down here. And in that t-table, let's stick in some useful numbers. Now, I had to do these from research before. I picked numbers and some of them didn't work out well, and then I chose some and they did work out well. But if we choose the number, for example, 0, then according to the blue equation, y would be equal to negative 1 fourth times 0 plus 3, which is equal to the number 3. So 0, 1, 2, 3 would be a point on the blue line. Now, let's plug in the number 4. 4, you might notice, even without trial and error, works well with the denominator of 4 in the fraction of negative 1 fourth. Negative 1 fourth times 4 plus 3 is equal to, let's see, negative 1 plus 3, which is equal to 2. So, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, comma, 2. And once you have two points drawn, you can easily draw the line that connects those two points. So let's draw that, and it looks something like so. Okay, now the green line, or the green equation. Let me start with the green. Okay, in the green equation, if we stick in the number, let's choose good numbers again, choose zero. If I plug in 0, then I get 2 times x, which is 0, minus 6, which is negative 6. So 0, comma, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I didn't quite go far enough. And there's negative 6. Now, let's plug in the number x equals 4. Now we get 2 times 4 minus 6, 2 times 4 is 8, minus 6 is 2, we go 1, 2, 3, 4, comma, 2, which is located right there. So similarly, if we draw this line in, we end up getting that drawing. I'm sorry, I don't have a ruler, so that's the best picture I can get out of here, but you can kind of see how these things are connected. So in particular, I was really fortunate here that 4, 2 was a point on the second line, the green line, and was also a point on the blue line. So that point right there of 4, 2 is common to both of the lines that were drawn, and therefore it is a solution to the system of equations. So when it says find the intersection of these two particular lines, the solution would be 4, 2.